Noel, a rather better evening for Frank Warren than he enjoyed recently in Manchester when his lightweight star Amir Khan was knocked out in just 54 seconds by Colombian Bradis Prescott. Well, Khan was a surprise visitor on the night, refusing to shy away from the public and facing his own ring future with real optimism. I'm not going to hide away. I'm going to come out and show my face out here and just be like I am. You know, just I'm a normal guy out here. Come to say hello to everyone and support this charity. You're always very positive, but how tough has this week been? Yeah, it has been tough, you know, because you've had people questioning you about the fight and, you know, having, having got a beat and getting knocked out and stuff. But, you know, I think that's boxing for you. You know, but I've, de I've, I've dealt with it okay. You know, it's not got to me. I've not got angry about it. I've not got too upset about it. Uh, but I know, you know, deeply I'm going to get, I'm, I'm going to come back. You know, I've got no excuses. The best man won on the night. He beat me and uh, we just have to live with that. It's the past now and I'm going to come back now. You know, I've got the future to look forward to. And it's all about just going and winning and not looking at a day like what happened last week. Has it affected your confidence at all? No, no, no not at all. You know, I, don't, I, don't, I lost a few fights in amateurs and I come back from it stronger. You know, I, I done 110 amateur fights, lost 10, lost nine, sorry. And I come back so strong and, um, you know, I, I, this is what I'm going to do this professional game. You know, I want to fight the best. And if I get beat, you know, if I get put down, I'm going to come back stronger. Uh, that, you know, you're still going to see a lot more of Amir Khan. You've had time to think about it, Jim. What do you think now about Khan in the future? Well, it's better that what happened happened now than, than this time next year, which has really have set him back. Something has to be addressed. He doesn't have the best chin in the world, but loads of people have won world titles who don't have the best chin in the world. He's been too easily matched in his first three years as a pro. He hasn't needed a defence. That's one of the reasons he hasn't had a defence. So he has to start boxing at a professional now, not like a top-class amateur. He has to calm down, slow the pace down, think what he's doing, and always be aware the other guy can hurt you. OK, just a quick remark.